Good morning guys and welcome back to another weekly vlog. Um, it's Tuesday. I'm failing in this whole weekly vlog thing. I was like, I'm in an hour in work to vlog this week, so I'm just putting it off purely because I'm not doing much and I don't want these vlogs to get boring and repetitive. Well, I'm doing something on Saturday, but Saturday's so far away. But I need to sort out my wardrobe now, so I thought, well, I'll, that's something that you're doing differently because you never sort out your wardrobe. <laughs> so here I am now. So yeah, I'm going to sort out my wardrobe because it is so, so full. I don't even know how it gets full. Well, I do because I do a haul a week, but still. Um, so the whole wardrobe thing needs to be sorted out. And yeah, that's the plan. That's what I'm going to do now anyway. So yeah. Guys, honestly, sorting out my wardrobe. Basically, when me and Dan went to Western um, a few weeks ago, about a month ago now it was, um i lost my driving license and um one of my store cards that i have for work um like my discount code my discount code my discount card so obviously the discount card was like easy to replace like my driving license obviously you have to pay for a replacement i've just found them both literally just found them um so that's great that's really good <laughs> they literally came yesterday as well. Like I only ordered them, reordered them both the other day, and it was in a skirt pocket. <laughs> hey ho! But this is the current stitch. So all that stuff I'm keeping, which probably isn't good because that's the majority of it. But then I just sort of pile out and give it to my cousin, um, and I think she just passes it around to her friends. Oh my god! Where the hell is my nail gone? Whoa, 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 guys! Is this a joke? Where's my nail gone? <gasps> oh my god, no. My nail snapped off somewhere as well. Okay, this is this, today's going really well. It's such a good day. <laughs> oh my god. That snapped off somewhere. I didn't even feel that snap off. And the camera isn't working either, so this is really good. But as you can see, I've also lost a nail. It's a good job I'm getting them done on Thursday. Guys, this is the current situation. I've got three bags sorted for my cousin, but <sighs> look at all this. I've started, so I've got two wardrobes. You guys probably know there's the other one, absolute tip. I've got two wardrobes. So the winter stuff was in the other wardrobe, obviously the summer stuff was in this one, but I'm swapping it over now. So I'm getting all my jumpers. Honestly, the wardrobe's gone so dark. He's just full of like pinks and yellows and oranges, and now it's like grey. Oh well. So much to sort out. Wow, I own too many clothes. I also need to sort this out because it's an absolute state. And that, and that just gets left. But these two need to get sorted out. It's such a tip. All done. I didn't do this bit because it just gets messy. It's just full of gym stuff and like dressing gowns. It's done dressing gown and my dressing gown. But this bit is a little bit more tidier than my wardrobe. <sighs> is. To be fair, my wardrobe wasn't even messy, it just needed sorting. It's a lot fuller than what it was, purely because I've had to move like jumpers into it. Um, but I've got jumpers, t shirts, sweatshirts, I've got a denim jacket there. There's joggers all along here, and then I've got some coats up here, some flannels, more denim jackets, and then these are all, <laughs> these are all my jeans, and these this goes quite far back, so yeah. That was that, and then I keep my bags. They're quite messy, and they're tidier than that, but I keep my bags on there. So, yeah. Hi, guys. World's Worst Vlogger is back. It's Thursday now. Um, I actually have a pretty sore throat. I really hope I'm not coming down with something. I swear I was talking about this in last week's vlog, but I still feel a little bit like, you know, you don't know if you're coming down with something. But I am now about to pop out to get my nails done, to get this sorted, um, and also have some food with a friend, and maybe do a bit of shopping. But uh, yeah, I'll update you guys when I get back anyway. And if I buy anything, then I'll let you know. But I'm going out Saturday night with Dan, my friend, and her boyfriend, like a little double date. <laughs> um, so I need a top. I need an outfit. I mean, I want to wear leather leggings, but I just don't know what to wear with it. So, um... Yeah, hopefully I'm going to find something, but we'll see. But I'll get back to you guys when I'm back, so yeah. Hello guys, um, so I'm back. That bottle is rattling and it's annoying me. 
So I got my nails and I'm actually really short. Um, I kind of didn't want them this short. But you know, do you know when you're like thinking they look really long? You're like, oh, just a little bit shorter. And then you say it like five times and you'll realize they're like stubs on your fingers. Um, the camera's not going to focus. Hang on. There we go. So they're like an ombre again, but they're like more of an autumn, not ombre. <laughs> so yeah, these are my nails. But I actually didn't pick up much at all. Uh, just some stuff from Primark. Good old cheese from Primark. That can be a thumbnail picture. Um, but what did I get from Primark? Got the world's best slippers. I actually think they've lowered the price. Four pounds for some slippers. Guys, I had some of these last year and they were the comfiest thing ever to exist, to known to mankind to ever, ever exist. The comfiest things are memory foam. Oh, they're so nice. So I got these ones. I had them in pink last year. I thought I'd get brown, spice things up. You know how it is. Uh, I then picked up two bubble hats with a £2.50 each. But I thought they were really, really cute. So yeah, guys, I'm actually fuming. So my boyfriend thought it'd be really funny this morning to cut my hair. He literally, so I had a bit of like hair dangling down here, and he's like, he's like, let me cut your baby hair. I was like, that's not baby hair. I was like, oh, let me cut it, let me shave it. It'll be funny. I honestly, I've got a full fringe going on now. I actually could have a full fringe or a side fringe. <laughs> I'm honestly fuming. But anyway, please ignore that piece of hair. But yeah, picks up two cute little bobble hats i think i'll probably wear this one more but i liked this color but this will go more but i prefer this color that's why we got two what's this oh i've got a tanning mitt from super drug picked up these wipes from primark they smell so good amy actually got me into these she had some and i robbed one i mean sister yeah i robbed one and i was like i mean not gonna lie i've just robbed one of your Actually, I ended up robbing about 10 in the end, so I did buy a new pack. Um, so, yeah, that was that. Um, then picked up a MUA brow pencil because my friend recommended it to me. So, yeah, picked up those. Like I say, only a small little Primark shop. We're out here trying to save money. So, that's sick. And then misguided. So, the first thing I got from misguided, I actually just wore today. Um, I also got my eyebrows threaded. Honest to God, it was so painful. I mean, I've done it a few times before, but the pain doesn't get easier. So, the first thing, they were both from the salon. I was just looking through a misguided salon the other morning. So, the first thing is just this really, like, big, oversized t-shirt. Like, it's huge. I've just got it on my grey leggings, if you can kind of tell. Um, but, yeah, it just says misguided on it. Don't know what the other stuff says on it, but, yeah, that was that. It's like £7. And then I've like got this. I haven't seen this one just yet. But, um, let's have a look. It's meant to be just like an oversized chunky knit jumper. And it was £15 in the sale. That's, oh my god, I love. It's so soft. We roll the neck. Okay, I actually love that. That is so damn nice. Okay, I love that. That's going to look really nice. With some like bright blue ripped jeans. I brought, oh, I actually picked up some stuff from work yesterday that I should probably show you. Uh, let me actually give you a little, a little show. If you guys don't know, I work at Dorothy Perkins. And you know what, they do some pretty alright stuff. So, first thing I picked up was this, um, it's actually high neck, but it's on the camera quite weirdly. This high neck, like, leopardy kind of jumper. Dan put it over the top of another t-shirt, did he? What is that hanging from the bottom? Oh, that was me trying it on last night. I was like, what is that? Yeah, so this jumper. Then picked up, where have they gone? These gorgeous trousers. They're giving me like Burberry vibes. These gorgeous like skinny, kind of like smart trousers. Which I feel like with a really nice cream jumper. And then picked up this coat as well from work. Which I said would go really nice. And let's say these trainers. I love these formal coats. Hang on, we could actually make an outfit. Wow. 
You know, like Jamie's 60 minute meals, this is like Amber's 20 second outfit. <laughs> this big black jumper from Misguided, this coat from Dorothy Perkins, it's actually from the petite section, so it fits like a nice, it's not long, it's more like a blazer, but it's like obviously nice and warm because it's a coat, so it's nice. These trousers and these trainers. These are from Pretty Little Thing, by the way. If I can find them, I'll link them down below. But yeah, isn't that a cute little outfit? Anyway, that, um, I see, like, oh my god, this piece of hair is really annoying me. <sighs> I actually am gonna see my boyfriend. Who the hell cuts a piece of hair? Who just goes up to their girlfriend with their razor and just goes, oh, do you know what? Actually, I'm gonna cut your hair because I think it'll be funny. Fuming. <laughs> right, I'm gonna tidy my room because it's an absolute mess. Um, a little update on the week. So it's Friday tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow I need to film a rebellious fashion haul, edit the rebellious fashion haul, upload the, rebe the rebellious fashion haul, edit uh, the Primark challenge with Dan. All these videos will already be on my channel. Um, and then I'm actually going out tomorrow night with Jess. If you guys remember the average grape days. Um, we're actually going out just into town for some food and for some cocktails. Amber is socialising, she's being an adult, she's doing girl things. Um, so yeah, my dad's going to drop me into town tomorrow night, I think, and then Dom will pick me up tomorrow night. And then Saturday, I think I said I'm going on a little double date, which I'm actually buzzing for, like, me and Dad have never been on a double date, so <laughs> excited for that, because we are low lives that don't socialise with anyone. <laughs> So that'll be nice. Um, yeah, with a friend I saw today, her and her boyfriend. So yeah, but that is my plan for this week. And then no doubt about it, I will spend all of Sunday hungover in bed because I drink like once every three months. So two nights on the trot. <laughs> yeah, can't wait. But uh, yeah, oh, also got a new phone case today. Uh, this is from Amazon. And the pop socket's actually from Beauty Bay. I got it from when I went to a Beauty Bay Beauty Bay and Jordan Lipscomb event. So I don't know if like it was just for that night or I doubt Beauty Bay sell pop sockets. But yeah, that's what the B stands for anyway. Good morning guys. A uh, happy Friday. So hang on. Um I have actually just spent the morning editing. Uh, Sunday's video, which would already have obviously gone live for you guys. Uh, it was the Primark challenge that I did with dance. I was actually like laughing at half editing it. I'm so sad. Um, and I'm just about to get ready to film the rebellious fashion video that goes live tomorrow for me, last Saturday for you guys. So yeah, that is the plan. Um, and then I need to edit that video, and then I'll be going out later, which I did say yesterday in the previous clip, I think. So yeah, that's, that is the plan. Um, but yeah, just for an update, you haven't really got anything else to say, I don't think. But yeah. Lunch time, so literally for lunch, I've just got my go-to uh, meal, which is uh, pasta, the tricolour pasta, Philadelphia, uh, oregano, yeah, oregano, pepper, salt, and some cup chilies because i really like spicy food so yeah I go to lunch and a bowl of water hi guys so i finished filming this is the aftermath of filming please ignore the bra <laughs> um but yeah i finished filming i'm honestly so impressed with all the stuff from rebellious fashion um i was just saying in the video like when you do a haul like nine times that's when you don't love everything but i'm honestly obsessed with everything i've just done in that haul it's so autumnal so if you haven't seen it be sure to check it out, I've got a discount code for it as well, um, so if you guys want to go check it out, that'll be great. But yeah, I've been feeling so sick all day. I started taking my pill again on quite a while ago now, it's like an almost a week ago, last Sunday. And every time I start taking a new packet after coming off my period, it makes me feel so sick. Does anyone else get like that? Like every time. Like Dan said to me the other day, goes, I hope that's not morning sickness, and I was like, no, it's not morning sickness, hen. Um, oh, I just feel so sick, so sick, oh, but um, yeah, I hope it goes, because obviously I'm meant to be going out in a couple of hours, but I just feel so ill, but yeah, that was that, I need to tidy up and then get editing, I'm so tired, so it's been so busy, but it'll be worth it. Right guys, I've actually just got ready and I'm heading out now, 
Uh, I think Dad's gonna drop me into town and then Dan's gonna pick me up because no drink driving. Um, but my little OOTD is, let's pop on a light. There we go. This little brown one-shouldered crop top, which is from Arlo just fell down the stairs, hence the crying. Um, but this one shoulder little crop top from Rebellious Fashion, these jeans are River Island, belt is also River Island, bag is a pretty little thing. Then I'm just going to wear these um, chunky white heels because they're comfy from New Look. So yeah. Hello guys. I'm not even going to say, well I will say what day it is, it's Monday. <laughs> are you not this weekly vlog anymore? But I'm here with my lamb sip. Wish I could say it's tea, but it's lamb sip. I wouldn't say I've got a cold, but you know, you definitely got one come in. Little, um, little thing about me is that I never just get a sore throat. When I've got a sore throat, I've got a cold come in. I've never just had a sore throat, if that makes sense. So, I've got quite a bad sore throat at the minute, so I'm on the lamb sips. But anyway, whew, I just walked upstairs, I'm out of breath. I did not vlog much this week at all, from what I can remember. So I don't want this vlog to be boring, so I asked you guys on Instagram for some questions and I just thought we'd do a nice little chilled, relaxed Q&A. Just a little Q&A to catch up. I'm not actually weekly vlogging this week, um, but there'll be a video to replace next Wednesday's, what, next Wednesday's video because I feel like these vlogs are just getting repetitive and boring now. Yeah, I feel like they're just getting a little bit boring and repetitive, so I'm going to have a week off vlogging, but like I said, there will be a video to replace it. We're not missing an upload, don't worry. Okay, first of all, I'm going to answer this question anyway, because I've had a lot of questions on it. It's not exactly juicy, but I keep getting asked loads of questions of where my wet lit leggings are from, um, from the Rebellious Fashion Hall, and they're also on my Instagram. They're from New Look last year. Um, please ignore the traffic outside as well. I'm filming by my window. This probably isn't a good spot, <laughs> but they're from New Look last year, although I do believe that they're back in this year as well. So yeah, new look. They're leggings, not trousers, but I prefer them. They fit me, like, perfectly, so yeah. Do you always wear your Tiffany necklace even when you sleep and shower? I do. Here it is. My little Tiffany necklace. The only time I don't wear this is when I scrub off my tan because I don't want to catch it and, like, rip it, break it. Um, yeah, my boyfriend got me this for Christmas last year. Um, it's just, like, the standard Tiffany necklace. One heart says, like, the Tiffany thing, and then the other heart has my boyfriend's initials on. Cute. But, yeah, I literally wear this all the time, as well as my little ring. I'm talking to this lad, but we like each other, but I don't know if he wants me for only one thing. I think you know, right? This is how you know. So, if you're speaking to a guy, and all he wants is for you to go around his house, like, oh, come round mine, no one's in, or, like, come round mine, or I'm going to come round yours, rather than being like, oh, let's go to the cinema tonight, or let's go bowling, or should we go shopping, like... That's how you know, like if they only ever want you around their house, you can kind of guess that they're only in it for one thing, personal experiences. Um, but whereas if they're like, oh, let's go to the cinema, let's go bowling, let's do this, let's do that, then you, they're interested in you, do you know what I mean? So, yeah. How long have you and Dan been together and do you argue a lot? Me and Dan have been together almost a year and a half now, which is honestly crazy. Well, I say almost a year and a half, it's like 16 months. Yeah, almost a year and a half, pretty much. Um, do we argue a lot? No. <laughs> we actually don't. Thankfully, Dan isn't an argumentative person, because if he was, then we probably would. Because <laughs> I'm terrible. But no, he's, li we're like, he's literally my best friend. I literally see him as my best friend as well. Like We just joke and laugh all the time. So yeah. How did you and Dan meet? Follow us on Instagram dropped him a little follow then I added him on snapchat which is weird because I'm not like that like I am not like that at all like maybe I'll drop a guy a follow on instagram but I would never like add their snapchat <laughs> as well because that's like real keen so I just like me and I have so many conversations of how everything happened that we both normally wouldn't do so it was like it was meant to happen like everything happens for a reason is what I believe in so yeah Best thing about living at home still, Arlo, honestly, hands down Arlo. Getting to see Arlo, my little brother, every day is the best thing ever. How do you learn to not overthink in situations? Honestly, if you find the answer, tell me. Because I don't know. <laughs> is your dad and mum the same as Arlo? Well, it says Arlo, I'm guessing it means Arlo. As Arlo's dad and mum, no. Me, Amy and Arlo have the same dad but different mums. Amy and Arlo have the same mum and dad. Me, Amy and Arlo have the same dad but different mums, i.e. my stepmom the parent of my brother and sister however my older brother Josh who's 18 months older than me 
um we have the same mum and dad he's my only he's like my only blood brother like full brother i thought i'd answer some little cues little cues for the q a didn't answer many um i just thought we'd have a nice little chat a little catch up but yeah i just want to sit and talk to you guys that's all i want to do my throat is killing me though for once amber cannot speak very much um but yeah I wish I could tell you exciting stuff that's happening in my life, but my life is just like boring, hence why the weekly vlogs are going to take a little bit of a backseat. Not completely, I will probably like vlog three weeks out of the four in a month, which is still a lot. Um, but I don't want you guys to get bored of me, I think that's like actually my biggest fear, is people just be like, okay, you're actually really boring now, see you later. Yeah, it's pretty sad. I'm also trying hard to think of like real good video ideas. Um... So if you guys have got any, be sure to let me know because I'm running out completely. Like, do you prefer like videos of me on my own or me like with my brother, my sister, Dan, my dad? What do you guys prefer? Be sure to let me know. But yeah, I'm sorry that this weekly vlog was boring. Don't worry, you won't have one for another two weeks now. It's, it's cool. It's cool. But uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog because there's nothing else for me to say. Hopefully I don't get too ill. Um, I'm actually doing not much this weekend this weekend this week um it's literally just a normal like filming editing day um but yeah thank you all so much for watching and we'll see you all very soon for another weekly vlog hopefully um so yeah thanks for watching bye guys